Welcome to our hospital. While you're here, your safety is our priority. And if you follow these eight simple steps, you can help keep yourself safe during your stay. To help prevent falls, please wear the hospital socks if provided, laced up or snug fitting shoes or slippers with rubber soles. Use your usual walking aids and if you need any assistance, tell us. To help prevent blood clots, wear your hospital stockings if you've been advised to and move as often as you can. Try to do simple leg and ankle exercises, drink fluids as recommended and take blood thinning tablets or injections as advised. To prevent infection, wash your hands before and after visiting the toilet and before all meals. Don't hesitate to ask our staff if they've washed their hands before any contact with you. Tell us if you have diarrhea or vomiting. If you have tubes or needles attached to you, ask staff why they are there and if you still need them. There's no need to be confused about your medicines. Tell us if you don't understand what your medicines are for or if you have an allergy. Talk to your doctor, nurse or pharmacist about any concerns you may have and ask about possible side effects. Pressure ulcers are not very nice, so if you can, try to keep mobile in bed and call us if you are uncomfortable. We are very happy to help you change position and, if necessary, we can provide you with a special mattress or cushion for support. Let us know if any of your personal information is wrong, like the name on your ID band, your address, your GP or your next of kin. Also tell us if you have any allergies and we'll give you a red ID band. If you have any concerns, don't forget we are here to help you. Talk to us if you have any worries or questions about your treatment or about what will happen when you leave hospital. Congratulations, you're leaving the hospital. But before you leave, make sure you have your discharge letter. You've got your medicines and they've been explained to you. You know who to contact if you have any questions or concerns and you know when your next appointment is. If you need any more information on how to make your stay with us safe, read the booklet provided or ask a member of staff.